Hello all, welcome to Learn with Castro. In this video, we will see the certification courses which are offered by Elsewhere. The courses which are offering by Elsewhere are extremely beneficial for research scholars, students, faculties who are willing to write a paper and also who are willing to publish a paper in a reputed journal. Elsewhere is giving a way of how to write a paper and, and what is the process of publishing a paper. Elsewhere is one of the top most publishing companies where every research author or every author aims to publish at least one paper. The reach of the papers which are published in elsewhere are across the globe and they impact the value to the author. The kind of research and the quality of the research are best proven by elsewhere. Any author who is looking forward to publish a paper in elsewhere makes the best out of the paper writing process. And in order to understand the paper writing process, the courses which I am going to show you now will be helpful. Let's look into the process of doing the certification courses and obtaining the certificate at free of cost. First, we have to open Elsewhere Researcher Academy. So this is the website which you have to open and in this website, you have to search for the first one. And as soon as you open, ensure that you made the sign in option. So you have to create an account in elsewhere in order to unlock the courses which are available. Now if you look here, the elsewhere unlock your research potential shows about five courses or five modules of the courses. Now here the first module is the preparation of research, second one is writing for research and third one is publication process which talks about the various publication details and how to publish a paper and the next one is navigating peer review that is how to review a paper and what is the process of review getting reviewed for a paper all these things will be discussed here and the next one is how to communicate a paper so once when we start writing the paper absolutely we'll finish writing the paper at on a given day once after finishing the paper we have to communicate it to the the journals or the conferences whichever we are aiming for now let's see what are the things that are included here now in research preparation if we click here you will get the number of modules that are available here now in the first case we'll be talking about the funding opportunities so under funding category we have four courses which are available the first course is how to secure funding and second one is funding hacks for researchers and third one is successful research grant application and the next one is discover how metrics can boost funding and network opportunities so these are the four certification courses which are available under the category of funding so you can do any course of your wish and you can also find the duration of the course which is available suppose if you are aiming to complete the course that is how to secure funding it is of almost one and a half hour and the other course that is funding hacks for researchers is for one hour duration now likewise you have different courses under different modules once after you complete the course you will be getting the certificate in the end of the video i will also show you a sample certificate for which i have completed a course now in the second category that is writing for research if you click here you are going to get all the writing category courses for various certification courses now you can check here the first one that is fundamentals of manuscript preparation that is how to prepare a research paper or how to prepare a manuscript in order to publish in a reputed journal and what are the writing skills that are required in order to write an efficient paper and it will also talk about the technical writing skills and you also have the course which is available on book writing especially this course is beneficial for the authors who are looking to write the scientific books or an academic books and the next phase publication process and under publication process you have fundamentals of publishing finding the right journal for right paper we write papers 
in different sectors of engineering or technology and science. Now, it is important to identify which journal is the best suitable journal for our paper. So, this course directs you how to find out the right journal for the paper or for the concept of the paper which you have written. So, then it talks, it, you have the quotes on ethics and then open science publication and how to publish in premium journals. Along with that, you also have a quotes on publishing in chemical sciences, which is helpful for the chemical engineers. And in the next module, you have the peer reviewed courses, the certification courses, which are available for peer reviewers. That means when can you peer review a paper and how can you peer review a paper? What is the process of peer reviewing and what are the benefits you obtain as an author or as a reader for peer reviewing a paper? And the last module talks about how to communicate your research to a journal or to a conference. So it talks about social impact, ensuring visibility and inclusion and diversity for researchers. Now suppose let's talk about one of the courses here. Suppose I am looking for writing for research codes. Here I am looking for fundamentals of manuscript preparation. Now I'll click here and then it will be directed to a page where I can find another sub four modules in that particular course. So here the four sub modules are structuring your article correctly. Next one is guide to reference managers and next one is how to prepare your manuscript and next one is how to write an abstract and improve your article. Now, whichever course you are interested at, you can click that course. Suppose I am interested to do how to prepare your manuscript. So I'll click here and then a 40 minute length video will obtain. So once the video is completely listened and I personally suggest to completely watch the video and then you are eligible to get the certificate. Don't just hurry to get the certificate. It is not all about the certificate. It is about process of knowing. So I recommend to watch the video completely and understand what are the metrics that they are talking about so that that will be helpful for you in the future. Once you have completely watched the video, you will get the certificate and after the entire duration of the course. So here it is an example of one certification courses. So here there are 15 pages. So once all the 15 pages are getting completed, you will get the certificate automatically, which is a downloadable one. I'll show you one of the codes which I have completed and also the certificate which I have received from elsewhere. So here I am showing you the one of the certificate which I have completed, which is under fundamentals of publishing. I have completed one of the courses, which is 10 reasons to get and use an ORCID ID. So ORCID ID is one of the most common discussions which happens between a research authors. So this course I have completed and this course is of 15 minutes of duration and I have got the certificate here. So here you can see at the end, you can see a bookmark and this bookmark, once the course is completed, you can find the bookmark is colored in orange color. Whereas the courses which you are studying or the courses which are ongoing, you will get the bookmark color as black. Likewise, you can do any of the courses which you are aiming to look for. So in research preparation, as I said earlier, you have 16 modules and in each module you have again sub courses which are available. So I request you to complete as many courses as you can because these are one of the best and useful resources which are available at free of cost. So you can do any of the courses. Simply you have to click on the research interest or click on the course which you are interested at and you can complete that particular course and that particular module. So all the courses which are available here are of a maximum of one and a half hour to two hours of duration. So you can finish these courses maybe in the span of 10 to 15 days by efficiently learning how to publish a paper and the process of publishing a paper. Now I'll show you the certificate which I have received on one of the courses which I have completed. So here is one of the certificates which I have completed and received successfully from the elsewhere certification course. So you can also receive these kind of certificates once after you complete any module and in any perfect research area. We'll meet in the next video by looking at other certification courses which are available for free. Thank you.